can go blind from looking at the sun. You can uh, lose your central vision, so you, know, you can be legally blind. During a solar eclipse, there's because it's such a spectacle um, and it's so interesting, there's a much higher uh, concern that people will look at the, at the sun and, and have damage caused by it. In the 80s, there was uh, you know, an eclipse that affected the United States and there were a number of reports of people losing vision um, from uh, viewing that solar eclipse. The retina is here, this uh, orange layer uh, that's in the back. And it, it extends all the way around, but the very uh, center of it here uh, is called the fovea, and that's responsible for your most precise vision. The ultraviolet uh, and very bright and high energy light gets focused by the lens right onto the fovea. And that initiates a chain of chemical and thermal reactions uh, of that fovea that causes tissue damage. In some cases that damage will uh, heal. In some cases it can leave uh, permanent uh, areas where you can't see. When I'm saying vision loss, I mean that your central vision is not as sharp as it is now. You can't see you know, crisp letters when you're reading or you have an area that you can't see in at all. And I don't mean total blindness, like something's black. There are types of uh, glasses that have been validated or certified by agencies like NASA. I have purchased the uh, number 14 Walters glasses and uh, they're very stylish and I'll, I'll wear them proudly. I'm very excited. Uh, I've never seen a, a, a total solar eclipse before, so I will be um, backpacking out in the Jefferson wilderness. I think you know the the message is, and something I take very seriously, is just you know don't take chances with uh, a really precious gift.